Good day YouTube. This is just a quick video comparison between Lubuntu 19.10 on the left and Lubuntu 20.04 on the right. So I put them in here in a bit of a linear fashion so as to not confuse anyone. I've done a bit of that before. But uh, starting off, uh, having a look, uh, they do look obviously quite similar here. I'll uh, throw up some terminal information just quickly about these ones now. But um, first up, we'll see the, the actual uh, desktop environment itself. So it's actually based on LXQT uh, or the LXDE uh, real desktop environment there and that's where the Lubuntu comes from Ubuntu with the L to begin with so basically in other words it is a very lightweight uh, desktop environment or, or distribution in there in general which means it does use a lot less uh, RAM off the bat there as well uh, now if I was to jump across to the uh, the window manager you'll find that this is actually mostly similar if not the same for the most part there so let's load up a few things here have a bit of a look and we've got the PC man FM uh, uh, file manager there or window manager there so nothing too crazy new or different with that one there either mostly the same for the most part there obviously this is all running on a virtual machine so you can see my Ubuntu in the background so pay a little to no attention to that um, now in terms of uh, things like the kernel so the kernel is obviously newer and the reason for that is uh, a couple of things not only is it a newer release it's actually 20.04 which means it's the long-term service release or should I say based on the long term service release of Ubuntu so it's supported for up to four or five years till about 2025 I believe and uh, this one here 1910 is a sort of a middle release that's only uh, supported for an extra year or so so if you do install the the one on the right here it will last you many many years on the same machine without the need to change which is really good to see there as well Let's see if I can uh, pull things out there a bit but um, yeah, next up is uh, the having a look at uh, maybe some of the apps, something that I don't too much get into because it is all the same sort of basic stuff. And if it's not, then you can actually download whatever you want. It is a Ubuntu distribution after all, so it's all the same basic stuff and download the extras where you need. But uh, this is just a bit of a look and feel for it. If I was to uh, have a look at uh, some of the RAM usage, straight off the bat, uh, yeah, it's using about the same, maybe a little bit less on the, the newer one, which is good, so it's a little bit more optimized there, that kind of thing, which is nice to see as well. But all in all, just a really lightweight uh, distribution for older PCs, for instance. Uh, one of probably the most lightest desktop environments uh, that you can get. Uh, with uh, except for maybe open box or something else but it's really a fully featured uh, desktop environment or operating system in general so it is something that I might recommend if you've got older hardware it's uh, just a little bit bare bones but it does everything that you would mostly expect from most Ubuntu uh, desktop uh, versions or environments there so that's pretty much it guys just a super simple quick fun video on that uh, thanks for watching please leave a comment subscribe and uh, yeah Thanks again. Cheers.